Oh, 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 wow. Who's that idiot? Oh, wait, that's me. So right now, I bet you're thinking, the title definitely says learning how to do a flip. So what was he doing? Well, to truly understand why I was doing that, we're gonna have to rewind a little bit. Now, fair warning, by the end of this video, you may still think I'm an idiot for doing this, but I promise you that you'll at least know why. And hopefully you'll learn a few things that you shouldn't do when you're learning how to do a flip. All right, let's get started. Jonathan learning stuff. What's up y'all? Oh, my elbow. What's up y'all? Welcome to another episode of Jonathan learning stuff. This week, my goal was to learn how to do this. Bam. In five days. Now, I've never done any kind of tricking or gymnastics or parkour before, so I'm a complete beginner. Press fish on the line, man. So was I able to do the impossible and learn this cheat gainer in five days, or did I just embarrass myself? Well, let's find out. So I started this week off by learning this move called the Makako. What did you say? A lot of the tutorials I watched said that this was a great way to get started, so I kept doing that all morning. But after doing all those macacos, I felt like I was ready to step it up in the afternoon. So I put on some safety gear and I started doing some 360s. <laughs> and eventually I went for some cheat gainers too. Oh, don't get me wrong. They were bad, but at least I tried. But one thing I was starting to notice was that even with the helmet and all those pads, I was still hesitating sometimes whenever I would go for a cheat gainer. And even though it was only Monday, I was already getting nervous about how the rest of the week would go. Man, this is hard. And honestly, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it this week, but I kept it pushing and I practiced some more on Tuesday. I was starting to get frustrated though. I had a lot of falls that day and I could tell I wasn't progressing at all. I knew what the problem was. Right now, really the only thing that I'm doing is just spinning around. I'm not flipping or anything, so there's still that fear of doing a backflip. So, gotta get over that somehow. But I didn't know how to solve it. I tried all the steps in the cheat That's gainer way. tutorial videos, but I still wasn't getting it. But maybe that wasn't it. Maybe I needed to get more creative. It's early, it's real early, but hopefully I'll get this cheat gainer today. Probably not though. By Wednesday, I was desperate very desperate. I wanted to get myself used to flipping, so I tried everything. I tried flipping from a bridge, but I'm too weak for that, so that didn't work. I tried using the handstand I learned last week to do a front flip. I broke my back. Fine. But that was stupid. I even tried doing a Kofi Kingston Trouble in Paradise. Looks like there's some trouble in paradise. But that was also a bust. And as you saw at the beginning of the video, I also tried this. That is what it looks like when you try to do a backflip and immediately get scared the second you start moving. Nothing worked. So since creativity didn't help, I figured that maybe the secret to the cheat gainer was just some good old fashioned grit and perseverance. Maybe I just needed to keep trying until I got it right. So that's what I did on Thursday. Day four, let's see if we can do this. I'm very tired right now. I tried and fell over and over and over again, but I that still wasn't able to get it. But maybe that just wasn't enough grit. Maybe I needed to put in even more work on Friday. I mean, it worked last week, so it only made sense to try it again this week. So that's what I did. So Friday was my last day to do a cheat gainer. And after many, many tries, here's what happened. I tried, I really tried this week, but I just could, I couldn't get it. I could not get it. Ah, <sighs> man, that sucks. I just couldn't get over the mental block this week. Like thinking about falling is just, it, it was too much for me, and especially on that grass. So next time I do it, like whenever I come back to this, I'm doing it in a tumbling gym as opposed to out there. Cause whew, I, like I've fallen before on that grass and it hurts. And I think that got into my mind a little bit and you can't let that happen if you're trying to do a flip. So, I don't know, uh, you know, this sucks, but hey, you know, we're gonna take some L's on this channel sometimes. So you just gotta keep it pushing and, uh, and try harder the next time. So, 
Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yep. We took an L this week. What do you mean, we? I guess it was bound to happen sooner or later, but it does kind of suck because we had a good streak going. But at the end of the day, it's all good because I'll be coming back to this one day and I'll definitely learn the cheat gainer when I do. All right, that's all I got. I really need to recover from all these insect bites and cuts from the last two weeks. So next week, I'm gonna be learning yoga. Finally, something easy for this channel. Lift your weight to the right foot, slowly begin to lift your body up. Or maybe not. <laughs> all right, until next time, love, peace, and tumble. Sir, you know what? Cut his mic. Look, I feel like I have to do one of these every week now, so they're not all gonna be winners, y'all. <laughs>